Hey Dazzlers, welcome back to my channel. As always, I hope that you are safe and doing well. This past weekend, I decided to try for the first time some of the Dollar Tree Plus items at my local store, and here's what happened. For this project, I purchased some 12 by 12 inch wood panels, some Dollar Tree Plus resin, as well as some metal flakes, and a few Dollar Tree supplies. I also used some Dollar Tree items that I already had at home. The first thing I did was cover the bottom of my wood panel with painter's tape, and then I added push pins to the corners to slightly lift the panel from my surface. I've decided to use gold, white, and black acrylic paint that I already had at home. I added two coats of white paint to my wood panel, and while that dried, I began preparing my resin. This is a two-part epoxy resin, so you'll need equal amounts of part A and part B. For this project, I'm using all of both containers. Because I'm using white as my primary color, you'll notice that I'm making more resin with the white paint. As you can see, I'm using my finger covers here, but this project gets really messy, so I would recommend that you use full latex gloves for this project. I'm using my fingers and a regular drinking straw to spread my resin across my wood panel.
Here, I'm using the rest of the resin to add more white paint to my design. Next, I used my heat gun to spread the resin as well as pop any air bubbles. Next, I added some extra fine glitter as well as some rhinestone gems, both from Dollar Tree. As you can see, a lot of my resin is running off the top left, so I did tilt my canvas a bit to the right in order to shift the resin and not lose all of the design. I continued using the same colors and a similar technique to create three additional resin wall panels. It took a full 24 hours for my resin to cure, but about 12 hours later, I removed my push pins and my painter's tape. The resin was already hard, but still not fully cured, so I made sure to be careful during this step. Unfortunately, I didn't record myself adding the metal flakes, but I simply used a barbecue skewer to add small flakes to the resin while it was still wet. I'll also share that because I wasn't pleased with how the sides of my panels turned out, I decided to paint them white afterwards. To hang my design, I'm using those same Dollar Tree push pins. And here's the finished look. I really love how my resin art turned out. I think it's beautiful. And for just over $10 per panel, I'm really happy with the Dollar Tree Plus items and the final results. But what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. As always, I would love to hear from you. 
I hope you enjoyed this week's video. If so, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, Dazzlers, bye.